Hello folks and welcome back to RimWorld. I'm Absurdities here, resuming play uh, episode 2 here. And uh, I've, I've planned out a couple little rooms out here in order to do our butchering and cooking. I'm also going to go ahead and... Oh, I didn't set that to deconstruct. Okay, we'll deconstruct those. And then I'm going to get rid of all the trees. Maybe not all the trees. We're going to get rid of a lot of the trees in this area. Maybe go ahead and haul... Not haul urgently, where's just regular haul? Haul things. I'm going to haul those out of the way. We have a chopped stump. Oh, I didn't. Stumps weren't a thing last time I played, so that's cool. Uh, we're going to probably set up some wind generators here. Not probably. We are going to do it. So that's under power. Wind turbine. And um, can we fit two here? Probably. Yeah, just. Are right, there some wind turbines. Maybe one of these actually become a small fridge. Okay. No. Changing my mind. I'm gonna do I'm gonna do what I said and I'm gonna do butchering in one of them uh, and then uh, and then cooking in the other. We use an electric stove. Yeah, it's outdoors for now. And let's get some... Let's get some wooden dining chairs. Why aren't you set to normal or better? I said I set quality builder. Huh. I get Jesse the dog wagging her tail at me. What do you need, Jesse? Uh, we have a visitor. An addiction council from Alloué is visiting the colony. She is named Sammy. Uh, yeah, Sam Gerador, aka Sammy. She seems to have a few items to trade. Well, we do not. So, come on and hang around for a little bit, Sammy. And uh, Jesse the dog has taken that as has come over and sniffed my arm and, and do things, which is fine. I'm uh, for those that don't know, I'm dog sinning. Uh, so this is not my regular setup and not my regular schedule. And once I'm home in the new year, things will resume normally. I'm putting out videos a little bit faster. And that'll be good. Hood is pregnant. Oh, one of our alpacas. That's cool. That's cool. Mm -mm, I'm fine with that. Where are you going through there? Oh, Sammy's coming through the cave. Let's see. Mega sloth. Nice. Well, yeah, let's just speed it up a little bit and let things move along. Here we go, Regis. Doing your thing. Is it cold out? 19 degrees C. No. No, I wouldn't call that cold. I don't know why it's like steaming breath. Everybody's asleep. Go ahead and jack up the speed. Visitors are leaving. Okay. I'm fine with that. This one thing I should work on is a path through the mountains. Um, so we can reveal the other sides. Let's just go. Let's just go here. Right clicks. Do a two wide thing about that far and see what happens. Clarex finishing the planting. And hopefully they got on with the wood cutting. Or they're cleaning. Okay, that's fine. Nothing wrong with having a clean area. Don't read into that, whatever I just said. 
Blocked by Papa. Larex, why aren't you chopping trees? Well, uh, cleaning is set to two is, is one reason, and Larex is not set to, to two priority on cleaning trees. There we go, now it's begun. Uh, I want you to come up here though, do that one, that one, that one. There we go. Gihondo's getting the mining done. It's excellent. There we go, we have power. We have no super need of power right now, but that's okay. Um, now, the butcher table, bills, we're going to butcher creature. We're just going to do that forever. Mad squirrel. Oh boy. Okay. Now we're going to grab everyone and bring them here. I guess we can come out this way. site Regis right there. And hopefully G Hondo just gets a good shot. Well and player X. There we go. No problem. This other squirrel's like my cousin. Pen needed. What are we going to make a pen out of? Um, fences. What about fences? About a wood fence gate. We'll throw it right on top of that stump. Maybe we'll put two of them. Wooden fence. go and then a pen marker an animal flap a doorway hung with thick overlapping strips of fabric or leather it allows animals to pass while insulating the temperature animal flaps are commonly used as barn doors to give penned animals a sheltered place to sleep is that necessary let me know in the comments if it's necessary to give them a sheltered place to sleep Uh, we need to run power wires. Waterproof conduit. Um, oh, for transmitting power under shallow water. We don't have shallow water. So let's just do this. And we can swap out that... Uh, that lamp. I don't know how far that's going to reach, so we'll wait. We'll wait until the power lines are in. Did I not finish the other side there? There we are. We're going to probably trap this guy in there if he doesn't uh, get a move on. Gene Honda, what are you doing? Coming back home. Alright, speed through the night. So quiet. Alright, back to work. Oh, he could. Uh, oh, they can. Uh, they climb over the fence. Of course, they can. That makes sense. G Hondo is off to dig our passage, I believe. Yeah. Does anyone's guess how thick the mountain is? I don't remember how thick it is through there. Also, can this learning helper go away? Nope. Guess not.
Get that skill, boy. Boy. Mining. Yeah. He's almost done as much as he can learning for the... Oh, for this, for the next level, not for the day. Right, right, right. Ooh, components, that's going to be useful later. Oh, since it looks like you'll be here for a while, G Honda thinks you should give your faction a name. What should your faction be called? Dewaror? No. Ometer Union? No. Whatever that was, no. No. East Errolor. If we call this cell Errolor, like this, this map, we are on the east side of the map. So East Errolor? Sure. Johanna thinks you should give the settlement a name. What should this local settlement be called? Oh, this is our faction. Dixieland. East and... Oh my gosh. What's our faction going to be called? Not the Labium Compact. Um... Can I... Can I... Can I select that later? No, I can't. I can't look at anything. I don't know what our religion's called right now. Uh, okay, we're gonna call it Cheyenne, and our people will be called the Concord of Absurdities. Not not like my name is spelled, but Absurdities, properly spelled. Also, that music is super loud. Uh, if the music sounds too loud to you guys, let me know as well, and I'll tweak it in the next. I'm going to set these episodes to release probably at the same time. Oh, hey, uh, an egg. I wonder if you're going to get pissed if we take their egg. Oh, hey, we, like, totally trapped them in there without even trying. Um, I want to find the animal pen thing. Let me have a look around here. In here, pen marker. Here we go. Oh, medium sized pen. Example animals. Cow capacity summer 1.2. Goat capacity summer 2.9. Oh, so this is like barely enough, maybe enough in summer to feed these two. Okay. Uh, we still have some hay. We have all 300. So we'll hang on to that. And uh, yeah, it is it is a raining. I suppose the one thing we need to do is to actually put doorways on these rooms to allow access. Oh thanks, game. Little hiccup. Did we uh, pop through? No, we didn't. He's just gonna go for the closer job, which is fine. Meanwhile, what's everyone else doing? Alling, I would expect. Yeah. Regis is deconstructing. Totally fine. We got some steel there we can deconstruct. What are these things? Oh, we can deconstruct those too. Ancients, giant wheel. Okay. What, what are they made out of? Who knows? Uh, it's metal. Is kind of what the, descript uh, the description says. Wow, my mouse doesn't work. Oh uh, yeah, we want to make sure that we don't go out there. Almost to the point where I could... I could set a zone. Hey, look! Is it more alpaca? It is more alpaca. We want to even tame them? Probably not. We've got our two. Um, okay. Pen. This is a pen now. So... 
Release to the wild? No. Area revealed. There we go. We've opened up the other side of the map. Make sure that everything is allowed. It is. And, ooh, looks like an ancient danger, perhaps? And we have a raid. A group of wasters from the site group have arrived nearby. They will prepare for a while, then attack. Prepare a defense or attack them preemptively. Okay. Uh, it's not so much a group, so much as one marine with a club. Well, you know what we have? People with guns. And where are you guys? We're gonna keep Regis back. I'm gonna try and just rope it open with the range. But fighting in the rain, not always the best, right? Shooting in the rain, I should say. Yeah, wander on down there. That would be smart. Can we get a shot? Yes, we can. Oh, half dead already. Alright, you know what? Pull back. If they're gonna pass out, I'd rather they pass out closer to our our area. He's he doesn't care. Never mind. Keep firing, assholes. Oh, well, or alpaca, you know. You'd shoot the alpaca too. He's down. Okay. Um, player X, why don't you go ahead and capture this person? We don't. We don't actually have a place deemed as a prison. Uh, we're going to... How do we do this? For colonists or prisoners, we're going to do that. Um, let's try and get some doors. Can we do... I don't know, marble doors? I don't know how much marble we have. Uh, enough. We have enough marble. So we'll do marble doors on the rooms. Allow, allow. And now we want to capture... I forgot about prisoners, man. First prisoners are pretty much the best way of getting new people. You can actually choose who you want to keep. I suppose that's the other thing. We, we didn't even look at their stats. Skagor, you are incapable of nothing. You're an undergrounder, which is fine, and a body modder, so you agree with our transhumanist things. So that's that's fine. And they have three burning passions. I'm okay with that. And you're not incapable of anything. So I think you would make a great recruit. Uh, how close to death are you? Oops. Seven hours. Okay. Now Regis is a minor break risk already. Jeez. I don't remember. Can we tend? Tend without medicine. Try and stabilize them anyways. Reminds me, we should go around the map and harvest any heal root that is, is ready to go. Uh, if we go into orders... We can... No, not harvest all plants. Harvest fully grown. So we can pick up a bit of food. A bit of heal root. That was actually a lot of plants. Alright, that's good. Cap 
capture. Squirrel meat rotted away in storage. Uh, yeah. Because I never made a fridge. Which is definitely a thing we should do. Also, Jihondo, can you put doors on things, please? Regis, you... Whoops, that's my bad. He was still drafted. Um, prioritize tending. Quality 18%. Cool. Totally great. Um, now, I do have the pharmacist mod as well as medical tab. Uh, I see. So we don't actually have them being allowed better medicine, but we will do that because I have a feeling with those 10 percentages, they'll probably get an infection. At least it's likely. Um, yeah, I need to uninstall or reinstall at... Reinstall at... There we go. Why? Okay, that was just weird. And maybe we'll install this one in here, just so we have a third bed for now. Uh, G Hondo, I'm gonna want you to do that. There you go. You can get your bed on the go. And where's Player X? Sleeping out in the rain. Sweet. Okay. Crisis sort of averted. I mean, they're they're not quite enclosed. Maybe you can go ahead and just finish that. Skagor is no longer incapable of what? You know what I should be doing? is marking this for prisoners, marking this for colonists, and, yeah, arrest them. Uh, we should... <laughs> they're trying to escape! Yeah. Of course they're trying to escape. Um, did we stop them, somehow? Yeah, by <laughs> by allowing the door to close, we stop them. Okay, we're gonna definitely have to get the food situation. Whoa, what what am I doing? Pressing the buttons. Yeah, we're gonna have to improve the food situation here. So, let's go ahead and just slap on a piece of building, or maybe we'll just reuse a piece of building here. I think that's what I'll do. Let's go ahead and mine that off. And then... I don't remember, is there... Yeah, there's a smooth designation for there. Uh, I want to... Uh, structure. Wooden door. I'm gonna put a door there. A door there. Doors there. And that's going to be our cold zone. Why did I do this? I don't know. Why do I do anything? Alright, reset your schedules, please. Get working on things. Um, we should probably tell them to haul these things out of the way. And we're gonna need, um, yeah, we're gonna need a place to put a, a freezer thing. Um... I forget how to do this stuff. Okay, cooler. We can do over wall cooler. That's 90 and 3. This is 90 and 3. 
Uh, sure. I don't think it matters too much. Oh yeah, we have to smooth those first though. Yeah, we gotta smooth those first. Can we get you to smooth that? I think, I think that'll turn it into a wall, won't it? I don't know, I'm gonna find out. Let's see. Yep, okay. You don't need to do that. You do need to do that. Okay, uh, power. We're gonna run some more power conduit down through here. We're gonna set this to minus nine. Then we're gonna set up a zone. Stock a zone. Mmm, having a thought, but it's fine. It's not the most efficient use of anything of, uh, of space. I'm just thinking if we're doing our butchering here and we're storing corpses here, it's it's not the best, but it, it's fine. This is this is temporary. Um, eventually, I'd like to move down here and make a proper base, but for now, we're just about survival. So this zone, we're going to go into storage. We're going to clear all, also turn off this filter. All foods are good, and all animal corpses allow large corpses, no human-like corpses, no mechanoid corpses, and no rotten. Priority is going to be preferred. And then we're going to need a place for corpses that we don't want to look at all the time. I think just around this corner will be fine. Uh, we'll call it a dumping stockpile zone. But we're going to clear all, allow fresh is off, and corpses can just go there. Low food! Yeah. Don't I know it. Uh, we do have some berries, which they can eat. And what are you doing? Oh, you're smoothing the wall. Okay. I think we're going to go ahead and cancel the rest of those walls. We don't need them smoothed. And it's staying pretty stable at minus nine in there, so that's good. Um, how's our rice coming? It's being harvested as we speak. That's great. Electric stove. We're going to do cook. We don't have any meat. Cook a vegetarian fine meal, huh? We could do that. It only requires 0.75 of one object. This is, this is way different. Way different than I'm used to. Vegetarian lavish meal. Let's just go cook vegetarian fine meals for now. Do until you have 10, 12, and that's good. Uh, we should probably put down floors and the rest of that. Structure. Structure. Where's floor? Brain? Floor? Is floor not there? Of course, floors have their own tab, which I, I forget these things. Um, sandstone. No, we, we know we have marble. Throw marble in there and there, please. See how that goes. I don't know what's underneath it, nor do I really care, I guess. Cool. Well, we are basically set to go for... We're making well, we're making food right now. That was a vegetarian fine meal with an egg in it? I guess so. I guess eggs are allowed, right? It's not vegan, it's vegetarian. And Jihondo is planting. Okay. You guys don't have enough to do, but 
I think I'll go ahead and pause there for now. Uh, thank you very much for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please do. I need those subscribes for, you know, goals, personal life goals, and as well as YouTube goals. Um, hoping to get a thousand in 2024. And, uh, yeah, I mean, we keep doing it. We'll, we'll get there. But, uh, the other thing is, uh, I'm trying to get the full 500 by New Year's, which is only, what, about a week away? We'll see how it goes. Uh, anyways, thank you for watching again. And uh, appreciate you. Yeah, stay safe. Take care. I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.